On October 22, 2022, authorities dispatched officers to a Target grocery store in response to a report about a customer causing a disturbance. The incident involved a cart of groceries for which the customer wanted Target to make reparations. So, who's, who got in the face? Uh, our, uh, I think our security teammate. Okay, well, and who hit him? Uh, they guessed that he... Right. Okay. 21, safe fire. Four four eight seven two seven. Four four eight twenty one. Repeat. Safer fire. So what happened? She okay. Being secure at twenty forty six. Okay. Came up. I tried to verbally de-escalate. Uh -huh. She told me that she wanted to wreck it out, and I told her we couldn't do that. Okay. And then she said, "Excuse me," and I was like, "Man, like I need you to back up or leave, like, but we can't do that for you." So she started charging at me. I came all the way back into my office, into an enclosed space, uh -huh. and I hit her in the face. Okay. All right, you and I have it all on video. Ma'am, are you okay? Physically, I'm okay. Emotionally, I am there. Our Fort David Thirty One. Okay. In front of the big lot, eight twenty five According to the manager's statement, a cashier called over the manager where the suspect was kind of whispering, asking her to make reparations regarding her groceries of over $1,000. The manager told the suspect that if she wanted a donation, she needed to call in the morning. This response led the suspect to become verbally aggressive, screaming and forcing the manager to back into the cafe counter. A security staff member intervened and told the suspect to calm down before the suspect began backing him into the security office while screaming. Inside the office, the security staff member punched the suspect in self-defense and then called the police. Those are my glasses that he knocked off my face, yes. I tried to close you out of my office and you just kept on pushing your way in. That's right. No, sir. I didn't push my way in. Yes, I did. No, I came around the corner quickly. Uh, hey, would you I did not push quit talking? Door. Hey, no. Excuse you! Stop talking when I'm telling you. You stop talking, okay? Do you know who I am? I, I will figure that out when I get your ID. You have cameras here, right? That's all, that's all that matters. You clearly don't know man, who I am. Man. Is your ID in here? Talking. Is your ID in here? No. Okay. Your ID is in here. May I see it? Sure. Why do you need my ID? And you're not taking his. To identify him. We know who he is. How? What's his name? We've been here What's many, many times. Man, you identified him. Can I have your ID? If I have to get my ID in this situation, I'll why get his ID mean? too. Don't exactly. worry about it. This, is, this has All right, to be right. You're just digging a hole here. No, Let me have we're going to do this the right way. We've been doing ID. it the wrong way for a ID. long... ID. No, he... Thank you. Have you. His. Thank your you. ID. Thank you. No, we're going to do this properly. If we're going to have this conversation, we will do it properly. So, if you want to go first, like, what, what happened? Okay, um, so I was walking by, mm -hmm. and Dee calls me and says that this woman asked to speak to a manager. Okay. Which, like, happens a lot, you know. So, I just go on. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. And she said, I'm not going to have enough money to pay for this. I need to talk to a manager. She happened to be walking by. Okay, and you were a manager? Okay. I'm closing and the so They started here. And you can finish that part. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I I came around and I was like, hey, what can I do for you? Okay. Usually it's like like a the price is wrong or whatever. Uh -huh. She starts going on this this spiel about uh, like about how like 
I've had a privileged life and she's been disadvantaged and then said that she was asking Target to make reparations for her and I said that's not something we can do tonight if like if you need a donation like you can call tomorrow I can put you in touch like, with the HR person but like, that isn't something I can do for you like right now tonight okay and then she like she was like you need to put me in touch with someone tonight and I was like I can't there isn't Okay. Like strange. Yeah. Strange. So, like, she just basically just kept saying that, and then she got really close to me. Mm-hmm. So I put my hands up and backed up, and she like followed me. She was like, like breathing into my eyeballs. Was she screaming at you or? Yeah. yeah. So she got really close to me. I put my hands up. I touched her shoulders mm-hmm. because she was like coming into my space. Okay. Um, and then she like. Because I touched her, she like went after that and just started screaming really loudly and like backing up against the soda machine. Okay. And then that's when like our security person, yeah, he called. She called our security person mm-hmm. and he came over and like intervened. So what caused the issue then here today? Because Check I came in. Target um, is somewhat of a home for me. And we were going to have a big discussion here. And I asked them to do it nicely. Who are you going to have this big discussion with? With Target. Whoever in Target I needed to speak with. What were you asking her to do? Reach out to her manager so we can have a larger discussion about how money works and how provision works and how it's been working in our community for a very long way. Can you elaborate a little bit, go into further detail? Sure. I was asking with the support of my community to come behind me in a big way to have a money conversation. There are more people subjugated and locked out of things. We have decided we were not going to have a bigger conversation. I decided to take a stand. This is my Rosa Parks moment, dude. Don't play with me. I'm just listening. That's all I'm doing. We're having a conversation about how to reconcile the fact that some people benefited off of a system that was great against other people. I asked nicely to have that conversation. Okay, what were you asking for? To talk to, for her to connect me with who I could talk to. What was your purpose of that con- that further conversation? What were you going to ask that person for to do? To break the lies around money. What's that mean? We all know money has not been treating everybody equally. Okay. Money is not the only way for things to happen. It's were, you, not, were you asking for them to make a donation, essentially? Or to let you have them for free? No, what was it? I was coming up to the limit of where I had money. I was trying to ask if Target would comp me the rest and we would have a conversation a bigger bubble up a bigger conversation about why because tar- i know the heart of this place okay it's the right place for me to have this conversation yeah, target's a good company exactly yeah. and i was trying to have a hard conversation in a safe place yeah so did you no 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 people hit me for that I did it the right way. And then when I, was I went through the right steps. They kept the reason the problem why money doesn't work right is because it blocks people at checkpoints. And I'm tired of people locking good people out. You don't get paid what you deserve. Nearly as much. Because choosing to do the right thing in this world costs us monetarily. That's not fair. The system is rigged against people doing the right thing. Okay. Because so, this world is selfish. I will disagree with that. There are good people, and I was trying to have a bigger discussion of that. How selfish people are holding other people down for that. Y'all are in this too. So, can I I live across, I, no, this is the aisle I crossed. Because my dad is a police, was a police officer in the military. Mm-hmm. He hit my mom. She called you guys. We lived in a white neighborhood. I knew you were good because I knew my dad. He was supposed to come in and mediate, but he wasn't comfortable with the way we looked. So he stood at the door and said, ma'am, you should just stay. And she listened, and it broke our entire family. 
he did not do his job because he was scared. I don't know. I will give you another example. Can I talk for a second? Sure. All right. So to simplify what happened outside, you had a certain amount of money that was with you, correct? And they asked, and you asked somebody to cover the rest, correct? That was your goal. That was your goal, correct? To cover the rest. Yes. And you, and, and were you Can I please finish? Yeah. Were you anticipating that that matter would be resolved right here, right now? No. Okay. I knew she. I, want, I asked her to put me in touch with Perfect. the you Because that would be unreasonable to anticipate exactly. that somebody at this level could monetarily exactly. make a decision for a business. But they blocked me from the bigger... Well, you could have called us. We could have absolutely helped you get a phone number. The internet's got phone numbers. We could have found it. You could have found That's it. That's fine, but I wasn't the wrong one in the situation. Um, Ashley was able to tell me as far as the door. Because the door, she said the door shut and she couldn't see you two inside. Yeah, so I tried to literally close her out but at that point she was like pretty much running so she barreled her way in and mm -hmm. then kept coming into my office okay yes and you just hit her and that's it hit her like right in the face like right in the girl um talking to ashley uh, minimum minimum tonight is banning her from from premises i'm guessing pressing charges something like that yeah ashley. attempted assault at least i mean yeah you can uh, stand up, let's go outside. Sure. Grab your, grab your bag. We'll explain everything outside. Why are we you want to go ahead and tell her she's not walking? Yeah, ma'am, as of today, you're trespassed from Target. I'm sorry? As of today, you're trespassed from Target. On the basis of you hitting me? Ma'am, let's go. Outside. No, no, that is not going to Either you walk out on your own or in handcuffs. Oh, I will be arrested for this cause. Come on. No, I'm not going to move. Make, don't make this nope. more difficult. You're gonna, it no, to it's going to be on camera. Where are you holding your lines at? Come on. So it's very it's very straightforward. Any business can refuse a customer. Mm -hmm. I go to Wendy's and I like my haircut. They don't have to serve does me. He have to, that is all he, this is. So he, he, has, gets, he gets the right to kick, kick me out after he hits me? He didn't bubble so that? He can't bubble that up in management? He is speaking asked, on behalf of the company at this really, point. Really? Exactly. So he can speak on behalf of the company at that level, but he couldn't do it there? I wasn't out there. I'm sure tensions were a little different than they are at this moment in time. So. <gasps> no, you're going to reconcile that. You're not going to give me any more lies. You will tell the truth about the situation. No, 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 no. You are trying to arrest me for him hitting me. Correct. You are under arrest. Yes. You're under arrest for menacing and disorderly conduct. Okay? Now, here's what we would like to do. We would Let's rather you walk outside thing. and not make a big deal. If you're going to make oh, a big no, deal, we're going to have to handcuff you and do yes, all that other stuff. Yes, you will. Yes, you will. Let's go. I'm not going to Don't move. get resisting to. Okay. Let's do it. Let's not. If we're gonna go into it, let's do it. If you're you're gonna hold every line, you know what you know what happened here. I know, I just watched the video. I asked to open a conversation and he's still blocking me out and you guys are protecting it. Ma'am. You chased the one employee all the way to the front, okay? You made contact with her body by pushing your body into hers. I just watched it clear as day on the video. Okay. He then came out and you followed him all the way back here. Okay. Making him fear for his safety. You backed him into an office and you got hit in the face, unfortunately. When people who are backed into a corner, they can choose, no, no, they can choose to do the right thing or they can choose to lash out. Okay, you were in the wrong here, just so we're clear. I held the line. You didn't hold and the I, line. No, no, I, I moved my line continuously. I asked, and when they did not respect, they were gatekeeping me. Like the whole world has kept people. Man, you were and free to leave at any time. Absolutely. But you didn't. Absolutely. So because it wasn't you right. You amplified the situation. No, no you wanted something When the laws funded. are not right, you, wanted something you make funded. a stand so they can change. Be ready to go outside. If the laws are meant to hold people down, you will fight for me, my community. Okay, let's go outside. Okay. You will come for me. Okay, let's go outside. I'm trying to give you the chance right now, just like before. You're, you're elevating the situation when it doesn't need to be. It's already done. It's not done. It's done. Absolutely Tonight not. Tonight is done. 
No, it's not. You're not. Your pe people that look like you are done trying to gatekeep people that look like me. No, ma'am. What happened? What happened? You got mad at them because they wouldn't give you your you card for free. I literally, no. Yes. You saw my heart. You understand what I was trying to do. I explained it to you. Yeah, you were trying to have them comp some of the extra stuff. Yes. Stuff well, that you could afford. A large conversation. And then that large conversation spoiled into this, unfortunately. And this Correct. is where we are. That this doesn't, is... just because your intentions were good, does not make this any less illegal, unfortunately. Right. So we but have. what happens when so laws give me two seconds. are not okay for people? We I, need to talk I have about to it. enforce the laws that are in place. Okay, that is our job, that is our goal. But he's not getting arrested for assault? He's not assault. He's defending himself. We are all, we're all watching this, right? Absolutely. We're all watching this together. You see where the police are holding the lines of my people? Ma'am, you were completely the laws, in the wrong. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. No, this but is here's the, the thing. problem. Even if we're wrong, that's what court's for. So we don't need to argue about it. We just have to go with what probable cause and what the law states, okay? You can't touch other people, okay? You can't make other people... You did You did. I watched the video, okay? You can't do that. You can't make people feel for their safety. That's why it's menacing, okay? You can't chase employees back in offices. I asked, That's disorderly conduct. He asked me. He was gatekeeping me. Ma'am, you were free to leave at any no, time. No, he, he, he knew about the police. He said... I will call the police. And instead of doing that, he ran back here. And you chased him. To have that conversation. No, you are completely wrong. No, there yes. was not at any time that my hands came up to do anything to anybody. You're not being when I did, with I stood my ground. Okay, and you and were when wrong. people, no, I wasn't. Standing your ground is not wrong if you're standing it in the truth. Okay. If there are places where the system is broken and rigged against people, Anybody. Okay. Here's the what we're rules do. need to change. Okay. They're not changing tonight. Okay. We have to go by the Ohio Revised Code. You're holding me down. This is what we're going to do right now in this you, moment? You are going right to get arrested. Arrest, arrest. Yes. For him hitting me. I'm clearing this up. Yes, ma'am. You know what I was trying to do? I understand what you're trying to do. It doesn't make it any less illegal what happened today, okay? I understand. So, but you're not talking, you're not having that bigger conversation with them and helping level them up in understanding. You know, I like, explained what you were, what you did. Just because there's a deeper thought and a deeper level that he, you have no, doesn't make it less deep, illegal. The deeper part was he wasn't the right person to have that conversation with. He did not do his part. Instead, he hit me. Defending himself, He hit yes. a woman. He hit a woman out of his own fear. I'm not disagreeing. He hit a woman today. Yeah, absolutely he did. And it was in his own defense. So what we are going to do is either A, we can walk out peacefully, or B, we can do it in cuffs. Why was he not, no, why was he not being arrested? And because he said he could have called the cops. He realized he had a choice in that and moment. And chased him into his office. So here's the okay, and we're done. I need you to turn around, put your hands behind your back. You're on your arrest. Thank you. Violate my rights as a human being to protect the law. Do you have anything on your person that's going to poke us, prod us, or cut us? No, okay. You see it? Good pe your job is with good people. I don't disagree that you're no, a good no, person. No, no, no. Here, keep on walking. We're almost here. No, we are having a conversation. Absolutely. We've, we've we'll have a conversation from the back life. seat. Come on. You're going to sit in the back seat with me? I'll stand outside the back seat with you. Okay. And I asked nicely, and I got refused, and I stood a line that scared them, and they lashed out. So do you think you could have approached it in a different manner than how we approached it today and probably got the same goal, the same end? Uh, how would you, how do you expect... I'm asking for something at the register to be done. Mm -hmm. The cash register couldn't, the cashier couldn't do it for me. I asked, they asked her to bubble it up to a manager. That's what you do. You take it up the chain of command. Absolutely you do. Yeah. But they, they, this is the problem. My people have been trying to take it up the chain of command and they're getting smacked back down because the laws are not in their favor. For you to take a hard stand, 
I, I just got hit. They were gatekeeping me. They didn't. They told me they were not so going to I help me. So can I just ask a? Just, I asked. No, no, no. I asked a very nice and polite question to that young lady. I said, she said, I am the only one here. I can't help you. I can't do that for you. Mm -hmm. Okay. I. Um, it was approaching. It was a little over a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars and a little bit of change. Mm -hmm. Where she was ringing it up, I could see that. It wasn't going, I wasn't going to be able to get everything without assistance. Yeah. Did you have like a coupon you could have used? Could you no, have asked sir. for a discount? Nothing no, like that. So you no, were, sir. you were out of money and you asked for a discount basically? Asked them to comp for like a couple hundred bucks? I asked them to have the larger conversation with me. Why is it that people, when it gets to a point where a young man reached out and hit an older black woman? Regardless of age, race, anything. It's you not, don't hit somebody. You don't hit people, but I can also understand why he did. He was defending himself. You How? you chased him into a closed office where he had no point of exit. Right, that was yeah. the point. I was forcing him to have a conversation. And you were forcing him to become scared and in fear. That's the downside. Let's say I fall. My I, people I, I have fall. been scared but and in fear. To, for me. My people have been scared and in fear to come into a lot of your places. Because yeah. you've, they've been if, kept if out. If I do the same thing as you just did, he'd probably hit me in the face too, though. But I have been kept out, and I was asking to come in, and he was continuing to keep me out. And you can't have it both ways. Either he had the authority, or he didn't. Either he reached up to his higher authority, because you know how it works. You Maybe he would have called him don't... tomorrow. You never know. I was asking for something to happen in that moment. He couldn't do that in that moment. That's not true. It seems like it may be. I don't I know. I don't her. have his opportunities. I, I don't know his her. job. I don't know how it works here. So I'm a police officer, not a target manager. The suspect was charged with menacing and disorderly conduct. After the court proceedings, the suspect's initial charge of menacing was acquitted, while the suspect was found guilty of disorderly conduct. Based on the court's finding, the suspect was sentenced to two days in jail.